who cares if you're all for animals I'm sorry I didn't mean it that way I mean like I don't um video as you can see by the title. Um, I'm going to be doing an unboxing because I just got a package from Daily Look and this is my first Daily Look order and I ordered the um, large structured tote bag which um, is like the Celine bag knockoff and the reason I decided to do this video is because I have been trying to buy this bag for like, I don't know, I've been looking at it for like a year and Every time I always tried to see pictures of it or people holding it or um, what it looked like in person versus just on the website, I could not find a single video. I think I found one and the girl had a huge haul so I had to wait. So this is strictly about the bag, opening it, and then I'm going to review it and then show you guys what it um, actually looks like um, on my, like with my body height and everything. So I'll go ahead and start opening it. And let's see, I think these bags are normally, I want to say like $74.99. Um, Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and open it up. And then there's a little gift wrap with a little sticker. All fancy. I'm just going to rip that off because I don't care. Um, and then it comes with a little, oh, okay, it's the receipt. It looks like a little book. It's quite nice. Okay, so let's go ahead and pull it off. It's so cute. So excited that I didn't have to pay $3,000. Okay, so here it is all closed up. I got the raspberry color um, because the nude and the black were $74.99 and then this one and I think navy or the other blue. There was like two different blues, but they almost looked exactly the same. The other one and this one were both um, on sale for $29.99. So I was like, yeah, I'm gonna get that. All right, let's take this out of here. Okay. Oh, it's so cute. And it is very structured. Okay, so when you open it, it comes with the little um, crossbody strap and these candles are gonna drive me crazy. Ugh. Get all of this off for you guys first before I show you the whole thing. Okay, so here we have the lovely bag. It looks a little more pink in the camera. Um, and it kind of doesn't want to stay open. Okay. Here is the bag. I'm gonna pull it back here. So here it is. Oh, it's so cute. I feel, I feel, I feel like I have money, you know, because it looks expensive. All right. So on the inside there is um, two pockets, like the typical um, like cell phone pocket, which I don't think my phone will fit in. And then it's got a pocket like right here, but it's really like tight. And then it has a pretty big, decent sized zipper pouch on that side. And this does zip closed. It zips, which I'm pretty excited about. That's why I really liked it because I need a tote bag that kind of closes for me. So zips right there. Um, and this front pocket is a real pocket, it's not just decoration. That actually could probably fit my phone or my keys. And then it's got like a little, honestly, I don't know what this thing is. I guess, I don't know if it's just decoration or something supposed to actually go through there. And let's go ahead and attach this. I think I'm gonna start using this. I go back to school 
in a few days. So I think that, well, I guess by the time you guys are watching this, I'm going back to school tomorrow. So, um, I think I might try to use this as my, um, school bag. Clip that on there. With bags like this, I just feel like I don't fit in the camera, you know, quite well. Ugh. And you can loosen it so it can be longer. So, longer strap, shorter strap, whatever. Or you could just probably leave it down if you wanted to. Um, and then carry it just on your arm. So, let's see if I can stand up and then show you guys um, how it looks on me. I am five foot two. All right, I'm not so tall. here is the bag. And so if I use that big strap, it goes, well, this is only half bud done. So it goes right about to my butt. And if I hold it, it's about, you know, I can hold it on my arm. I cannot fit it all the way up my arm. I have fatter arms. So maybe if you have smaller arms, it'll work. But there we go, size-wise. Works out pretty good. All right, so go ahead and tell me what you guys think. And maybe if you guys have this handbag, um, they did have it in a mini size, which on the website they actually showed a, uh, like a, they showed it on a person. This one they did not show on a human, they just showed the bag. Um, but the mini one they showed, and it looked way too small for me. I don't think I would have been able to really fit that much in there at all. Um, so overall, I mean, I think I, I think it was definitely worth the money. I mean, even if I would have paid $75 for it, I think maybe it would have been okay. It also came with this weird, this little tag, but it came with like a piece, an extra piece of fabric, which I'm not, I don't know, I'm not really sure what that goes to. I guess if something rips, I don't know. Um, but I mean the quality feels really good. I don't know if this is real leather or not, but I mean who cares? If it's fake leather, I'm not really. It feels nice. It feels like good quality. It's sturdy. It's structured. Um, it looks like it's going to hold up really good. So, and I've been obsessed with this raspberry color. Um, it is the... It's kind of like, I don't know, in the camera it looks bright pink, but in person it's like that, um, the Radiant Orchid color from like the color of the year last year. So, I don't know, I fell in that love with that color. So, um, if you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up and tell your friends about it. Please subscribe and, um, I will have new videos out every Sunday. Come back and see me next week. Bye guys. Ooh, there you go. <laughs> Your lens went out.